Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And today I am bringing you guys a video of a DIY, a short DIY video of me turning this oversized crew neck sweatshirt into a crop sweatshirt. Um, it's pretty easy. I've had this sweater for a while. So if you guys have any sweaters or any crew necks, anything that you have just sitting around or that you've had for a while and you want to just give it a new look and switch it up, I think this would be the perfect video for you all. So yes, let's get this thing rocking. Some of the supplies you will need is cord stops. Um, you will need some scissors as well as any type of string. I had this gold string laying around, but you can use like some shoe strings or whatever you prefer. So now with my sweatshirt folded in half, I'm going to go ahead and take my ruler and chalk and I'm going to just mark where I want to cut my sweatshirt. And once I got that all figured out, I laid my sweater out and then I just started cutting straight across. Once I got halfway, I went ahead and folded it again. And I did this just to make sure that everything is lined up because I don't want anything to be crooked or anything to be off that way it would not look right so as you can see now I'm going to go ahead and continue cutting all the way across and voila so now it should look like this and once I got to this point I figured that I want to hem the bottom and so I am going to a, I'm going to do a double hem um, so it's going to be about a half an inch double hem at the bottom and so that means I'm just going to turn it once like this then turn it again so you should have two turns just like that and then you're going to sew do that all the way around and sew all the way around you can sew by hand but since I have a sewing machine I decided to just use that because sewing by hand takes a little bit longer and then also you will want to pin your sweater just like this all the way across Alright, so now I took my sweatshirt to my sewing machine and started sewing at a half inch seam allowance. And I sewed all the way around till I got to the other end where I left an opening or a small gap and you will see that coming up. Alright, so now I am all done and I just went ahead and clipped the ends. And I also left a space open for me to put my string through. Alright, so this is what my sweatshirt is looking like so far and now I'm going to go ahead and put a hole right there in the middle and I want to make the hole deep enough to pull the string through but I don't want to make the hole um, deep enough where I am making a hole on the other end of the sweatshirt. So just deep enough to pull the string through. Alright, so now I'm going to go ahead and take my string and I put a safety pin on the end of my string to help you pull the string through the sweater and I'm going to just go ahead and take that all the way through until I get to the other end. Alright so now I am done and I just cut off some excess string off that I didn't need and I'm going to go ahead and tie that in a knot. And when I do make this knot, I want to make sure that when I tuck it inside of my sweater that I want to tuck it as far away as I can from the hole. Because when I pull on the string, I don't want that knot to be seen or I don't want it to come out. So yes, it'll make sense later on once I put the cord stop on. Next, I went ahead and stitched this opening closed. So now I'm just going to go ahead and take my seam ripper and try to pull that string through. And if you don't have one of these, you can just take any sharp um, object with a, or any object with a sharp end to help you pull that um, string through. And if your hole right there was looking mad bogus like mine's was, um, it's okay because we have this 
cord stop which is going to cover that up as you can see you can't even see the hole right now so it's looking pretty good and you don't even have to worry about that hole because it's no big deal so I'm happy how it turned out but let's see how it looks on all right so this is how my sweatshirt turned out so I now have a cropped sweatshirt I'm really loving how this turned out let me know what y'all think let me know if y'all enjoyed watching my video and let me know if y'all liked how this turned out and if y'all did go ahead and give me a thumbs up and if you are new to my channel of course go ahead and subscribe to my channel and if you want to see more videos like this go ahead and hit that notification bell because I will be uploading more videos on easy DIYs and a bunch of other topics alright you guys I will catch you all on the next video Thank you guys for tuning in. See you later.